seen this guy before. You can see it's about the same size as your smartphone, but it is 10,000 milliamps of power. And once you charge it up, it stays charged up for a really long time. It's not one of those devices that if you leave it sitting there for two weeks, all the power drains out of it, if you know what I mean. So this one, you can leave in your glove box. You can leave it in a drawer for emergencies. You can use it every day if you want to. It charges up quickly, but again, retains that charge. So this is um, the color that I'm holding, which is rosewood. Isn't that pretty? And then all the other colors are down here in the front. So up top is the pink. Then we have your silver. Rosewood right next to that. We also have it for you in slate blue and we have it for you in green. It comes along with built in cables that are inside the unit itself. They just kind of tuck in. You can see one's kind of fanned out there on the side. Uh, you're going to get the lightning cable, a micro USB and the USB C cable included as well. And then you're also going to get the charging cable to charge it up. On the phone, we have Michael Padula, who is an electronics expert. Always nice to have you here, Michael. Come on in. Always nice to be here. Hi. Carol. Thank you so much. More than just on the phone, I'm actually. I'm I here. know what. So I had it, to be here with you. So nice to have your handsome face. So actually, you sent me a lot of information about this, and I want to thank you for that. But Pongo actually stands for power on the go. Oh. And this is a brand that some of our customers may not be familiar with. So tell us all about it. Sure, Carolyn, it's a brand that your customer, our customer, our family, our, our QVC family may not be familiar with, but listen, get familiar with Pongo, because let me tell you why, you said it right, power on the go. I love this guy, I love the name of it, I love how small it is, and especially, I love how powerful it is. So essentially, we have a power bank, we have an external battery that we all need, right? Because we've all got screens, we've all got personal devices. By the way, this mess on my desk here, this is all for a reason, okay? I promise we're gonna get to it. Every one of these devices you're gonna see is being charged by my Pongo, right? By my power bank, my, my 10,000 milliamp Pongo power bank. I'm charging an, an iPad, I'm charging a mini iPad, I'm charging some um, sharp earbuds, some AirPods, uh, my crack phone, my mm -hmm. crack phone, it's non-Apple, obviously, a set of over-the-ear earbuds, and, uh, and an iPhone. Okay, so all of these things can be charged by the Pongo. Why? Because it's got a micro USB port, it's got a USB-C port, and it's got a light port. So with your Pongo, you're going to get slim, compact design, crazy powerful, 10,000 milliamps. A lot of power banks that you're used to seeing come with 5,000. Some come with eight, uh -huh. a few come with 10. This has 10, this has the attached wires, has an external digital display. And Carolyn, I went a little far this week. I was playing with my Pongo and I shot a little video. We're gonna to get to it at some point. You're gonna see uh -oh. just how powerful this Pongo is. Okay. Pretty incredible. All right, Michael, I have to interrupt you for a second because these are flying out of here. I just wanna show the colors again. So the pink is on the top. The other pink one's called Rosewood. That's kind of that darker blush pink. Then we have silver, slate blue, and then we have it for you in green. Uh, this, at this price and this small, you never find this much power. You don't have to have a big box or something that looks like a, like a large uh, you know, square device. This is the same size as your smartphone, but it has 10,000 milliamps of power and the lightning micro USB and USB-C uh, included. Those ports are there, so you can charge up to three devices. Um, let's see your video. I want to see what you did. Let's do it. So the video has dual purpose. Now look, I've got a, a dead iPhone on the left and I've got my cracked phone on the right. Both of them are dead. I'm gonna pull open my Pongo, pull the attached lightning cable out, pop it in the bottom of my iPhone, gonna charge my iPhone from dead to, hmm, I'm gonna hold the secret. You're gonna see at the end of this video. You can see I've got 100% of charge and completely dead on my iPhone there. 100% on my Pongo going to pop in the uh, the attached USB-C cord that's going to repower my track phone, right? So I just, I'm not super familiar with my track phone, so it took me a second or two to get it plugged in there. But that's all you do, plug it in and let it do its work. Now, here is a little it's time, that's what I'm telling you right there. So this is a 15 minute time lapse section of the video. So within 15 minutes, you're going to see, I, I kind of danced around in the screen there a little bit, so you can see that this is 15 minutes of time. It's not in real time. At the end of this 15 minutes, you're gonna see, see how the digital display on the Pongo starts to tick down? So it's going to get down to, and we'll get to it at the end of this, but in, in 15 minutes, we're only depleting the Pongo by about 8%. Wow. It gets down to about 92% 
and just watch how powered up I get these two devices simultaneously using the Pongo, using the attached cords, right? 15 minutes is up. I'm going to pull this up. Wow. So I've got 9% okay. of charge uh -huh. on my track phone. And remember, that was charging the same time uh -huh. that my iPhone was charging. Uh -huh. Check this out. iPhone gets charged 24%. Wow. I'm at 24% of battery. So the point is, what does it do? It helps you feel safe. It always reminds you that you've got yeah. power with you. If you've got that young person who's going back to school, if you've got somebody in your family that always forgets to charge their phone, like you said a second ago, Carolyn, mm -hmm. throw it in the glove box, yeah. throw it in the backpack, throw it in your pocketbook. The charge on this can last. I've heard of them lasting up to a year, a year. Once you charge this bad boy, it's got a charge on it for up to a year. You throw it wherever you're going to, pull it back open in about three to six months, yeah. check the battery on it. By the way, this comes with, it's a, it, uh, it comes with a little charging cable. So all you do is plug this in, Charge your Pongo, it holds your charge, and then it powers everything. And it you holds see it here. for a long time. I want to mention, too, that I love it has attached cables because how often have you got in the car and realized that your phone's almost out of juice? You've got those great USB ports in your car, but there's no cable. So they're not doing you any good because there's nothing to connect your phone to the charger that's built into your car. So have this in the glove box, keep it in your purse. When you happen to run out of power, you know, sometimes you're doing a Zoom chat or something, Michael, and you know, my iPhone really, I've got a newer iPhone, and when you're on those, those little um, Zoom chats and things, it really uses up the power. So Absolutely. if you don't carry your cord around with you all the time, there's no way to charge up your phone. And then you're like, I'm telling my husband, stop texting me. I'm not home yet. I might need, <laughs> I might need to make a call. Quit texting me. You're using up my, my power because it's down in the red, right? You don't ever have to worry about that anymore because this is got the cables built in and it's got a ton of power in it. 10,000 milliamps. We saw how you were able to get a good amount of power back into both of those dead phones in just 15 minutes and you only used up 8% of the power in your Pongo, which was really impressive. It sure is. And Carolyn, I know that we have this as a, as a uh, you know, God forbid we ever need this in case of an emergency, mm -hmm. right? And we've right. seen emergencies happen this week and that's terrible. And like I said, God forbid that ever happened. This is good for the daily drain of your devices, right? When the kids are in the back seat and one of them forgot to change or charge their controller, you're not going to string the cord back from the right. front seat to the back seat. Uh -huh. A lot of us like to play on our phones while we're sitting in front of TV at night, right? right? If, you, if you play words with friends or if you play games on your phone, a lot of us don't want to run a cord from the recliner all the way across the room to the, uh, to the, to the plug. So right. you don't have to anymore. Power bank is no good to you if you don't have the charging cable. Well, this one comes with it built in. So you've got the slim compact design, like you said a second ago, it's the size of your cell phone, right? right? This is my actual cell, it's my real cell phone. And this is my Pongo and they are the same size. So same size, it's not a giant brick. Right. In the stores, you're gonna see them, they're either like this big or I know. they cost over a hundred dollars. They don't come with the cord. Pongo is this small, this powerful, comes with the cord, gives you that peace of mind. In case of an emergency, you've got it on hand. And if you're just for your daily draining of your devices, you've got it too. It's no going to charge your tablets, charge your phones, uh, your cameras. Uh, and, you know, you don't you have a couple of different types of phones there, including a flip phone, which, you know, you can charge as well. So it actually comes with all of the uh, cables that you'll need. So some phones need a lightning cable if you're doing an Apple phone. Uh, it also has a micro USB for your Android devices and the newer phones that use the USB-C. It includes all of them. So this is very popular. It's a storm essential. You don't ever want to run out of juice on your phone. If your phone service, your landline is out, out, uh, or you can't plug something into the wall to charge it up because the power might be out. You need to have some kind of communication. And if you have kids, you know how imp important it is that their phones are working and that your phone mom is also working if they try to call you. So here we have the pink, we have the green, we have the slate blue, the rosewood is that deeper blush color, and then we also have it for you in silver. All five are very popular. This is also a great back to school or tuck it away for a stocking stuffer. Everybody can use these. Five payments of 882. Michael, always a pleasure. Thanks for being here. Thanks so much, Killer, and always a pleasure. All right, and here's Allie. What you got cooking over there, girlfriend? Okay, I want to 